It's time for Raw. We're coming to you live from deep in the Lone Star State in Dallas, Texas. There's no doubt this is one of the most exciting lineups we've had in a month of Sunday, so stay tuned. And what a great way. Up next, we have singles action. It'll be Braun Strowman versus Titus O'Neil. Oh, I cannot wait. Matchup about to get underway, and Corey, we have company. What on earth is this all about? This superstar has nothing to do with the matchup. Well, this superstar is an arch rival of one of the superstars in the ring, so I can understand this person uh, heading down here, I guess, to scout the matchup. Well, it's one thing to take a closer look. It's another to involve yourself in an opponent's business causing quite the distraction so far. Superstar better have eyes in the back of their head. The superstars are ready and so are we. Here we go. Oh man, this is gonna be great. And guys, every time WWE is in Dallas, fans turn out in record numbers, and tonight is no different. What do you expect his approach to be here? He's seen the trainers and put in good work to come back here. A win would make the effort all worthwhile. Well, some superstars thrive in this big spotlight, and some wilt. We'll see which one he is real soon here. This has been one heck of a matchup already. Whipped into the corner. And now words exchanged between the superstar in the ring and the superstar outside the ring. And superstar inside better focus on the match at hand, not what's going on outside. And case in point right there, Corey. A right hand. Big miss for him there. And he'll likely pay for it here. Throw it all over the ring with a strong Irish whip. Three. Strowman is feeling it right here. Look, Titus O'Neil's on the attack now. Four. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. Five. He wants no part of the outside. Titus O'Neil with a nice reversal. I don't want to know what that feels like. Looking at it here. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. A nice shot by Titus O'Neil. Look, Titus O'Neil's on the attack now. It looks like Titus O'Neil has got the momentum. And Byron, this takes a ton of strength to pull off, am I right? Oh, you are definitely right, Michael. But you also have to remember how much energy it drains to pull off. with authority. He misses the mark. He might need glasses, Cole. His eyesight is clearly compromised. And it's Titus O'Neil with the reversal. Ron Strowman is going to have to revise his game plan because right now, the one he's using ain't working. 
This is not where he wants to be at this point in this match. WWE.com poll had him as the overwhelming favorite leading into this match, but he's definitely not looking like the favorite so much right now. Boy, at this point, he's going to need to have some magic up his sleeve if he wants to get back in this match. Check out Braun Strowman's offense. Oh, and he connects. There's no reason to lose your footing on a move like that. Come on, toughen up. We may be looking at a power bomb here. That's exactly what it looks like to me, Cole. Looks like a power bomb coming up. There may be no escaping this one, Cole. It's a long way down from there, Cole. Look, Titus O'Neil's on the attack now. This is a scenario where if you're on the receiving end like he is, you think Murphy's Law has arrived. He wants no part of the outside. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, and a terrific reversal by Braun Strowman. The monster among men picks his opponent up. Oh my gosh, from what heights. Warm up the bus, this one is over. That is exactly what Braun Strowman needed. Oh, hellacious power slam. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Oh man, Titus O'Neil doesn't even know where he is. He may get the three count right there. Still trying to get back to his feet here. He's clearly in a bad way right now. Check out Braun Strowman's offense. There's the cover. Can he do it? Two! I think that kick out surprised everyone. Wow, if you it was the real deal before, you can't now. The will to survive. He's pressing all the right buttons now. Here he goes for the win. He gets it with a reversal. Getting nailed with a strike like that lets you know just what kind of fight you're in. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. And just like that, this move is leading the charge. And again, Titus O'Neil pours on the aggression. This has been a war. Oh, oh, threw him out like trash. This one is over. Pays for that one. Guys, when you have as trained an eye as I do, you get to a point where you can see the finisher coming before it actually comes. And let me tip you off to something here. It's coming, and it's coming very soon. Takes him face down. Camel clutch locked in. Just about there. Braun Strowman gets the win.
here is your winner, Braun Strowman. And that's a win to start off the night. Yeah, the performance put forth in that match tells me we're looking at somebody who will someday, very soon, be competing in the main event. Plenty more action still to come here tonight, folks. What's this all about? Man, it's on now. Let's see what she has to say. Seems to be a lot of anger behind those words. I think that said it all. Well, that'll work if you need it to. Talking is one thing, but performing is another. Going to be a tall order for the next match to live up to its billing, but I'm optimistic. I wish I had two heads because I'm going to need them to watch this three-on-three -three action. Coming up next is a huge six-man tag team match. We have the new day. Taking on Sanity. Pandemonium and Chaos Hall. Oh, don't go anywhere.
our WWE Universe! Don't you dare be sour! Clap for your longest reigning tag champs and feel the power! The following six-man contest is a tag team match set for one fall. On the way to the ring, at a combined weight of 702 pounds, Big E, Kofi Kingston, and Xavier Woods, The New Day. It's now time for our huge six-man tag team match. And I can't think of any competitors I'd rather see go at it right now than these six superstars. This one's going to be great. At a combined weight of 799 pounds, Alexander Wolf, Eric Young, and Killian Dane. Sanity! Folks, Alexander Wolf is about as unstable as it gets. Which makes me wonder why anybody would agree to step into the ring with him. And we're underway with six of WWE's top superstars going at it. And from what I heard, I-35 East was backed up for hours this afternoon with fans hoping to get tickets to see this match. Check out Big E's offense. us about Big E. He needs to be prepared for the fact that there will be action all around him. But is that something you can really prepare for? When you're not used to relying on two others, these types of matches can be tough to adjust to. I'll be interested to see how this one plays out. Big E starting to slow down a bit here. I think it's safe to say that the action so far in this six-man tag team match is exactly what we expected.
He goes to the quick pin attempt. There's not a person in this arena who thought that was it for him. Just needs to do more damage. I'll give credit where credit's due. The chance for Big E are definite. The WWE Universe certainly agrees that New Day rocks, and this powerhouse is a major reason for that. But ugh, I feel sick after acknowledging that. Not every move is designed to get the fans off their feet. This is a tough spot to find yourself in, that's for sure. But if anybody could break free from this, it's this superstar right here. What do you think Big E needs to do to get back in this battle? Rather than continuing to absorb any more punishment, he might want to tag out here. At this point, he really has to think about mixing it up a bit. Maybe implement more of a power game into his offense. Come on, Corey. We all know how you love to start your day with a giant bowl of booty -o cereal. No matter how you look at it, Big E is one of the most popular superstars in WWE. I personally love starting each day with a bowl of booty -os. Sometimes I'll even have two bowls. When Big E steps through that curtain, the WWE Universe loses their minds. And that's not by accident. Bad move there. I don't know what made him think that was a good idea. And the boot is administered. Never pleasant. Check out Xavier Woods' offense. <laughs> Xavier Woods really feeling the heat now. And you know all three of the superstars he's up against won't back down at any point during this match. You know, there's an art to being a successful tag team competitor. And right now, he resembles more of a finger painter. He seemed more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. Looking to make a much needed... And he tags his partner in. Momentum has certainly shifted here, Michael. Drops the fist on him. And Byron, he's still down after that one. Yeah, that did some big time damage, Michael. Three. Big E is really feeling it now. He's going for it all. Here we go, back inside the ring. And I think it's clear that Big E is feeling the physicality of this match. He may very well have reached the point of no return here in this six-man tag team match. There's no way to sugarcoat this one. He's getting absolutely destroyed right now. He may be in the best physical condition I've ever seen him in. Oh, he turns it around. He is a real man. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. Tagged in. Man, it's like getting hit with a school bus. This one is over. Things just went from bad to worse for Big E. This is some great offense by Eric Young. And he lands a savage elbow. Keep your eye on this one. 
There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Whoa! Reverses that one. Check out Xavier Woods' offense. Having some fun now. Pays for that one. This can go a variety of different ways, Corey. And almost none of them are good. This is some great offense by Eric Young. Four. The outside. Five. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. And it's Xavier Woods executing the reversal. Ain't no stopping him now. He's focusing on the face now. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Eric Young in full control right now. Right where he wants him. Death Valley driver. Here's his moment, Michael. This could be it for him, guys. Yeah, he's on Dream Street. Tagged in. Alexander Wolf in control here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Sit up. Powerball. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Things just went from bad to worse for Xavier Woods. He's in trouble. Wow, I thought he was a goner. Not today. Xavier Woods with a nice reversal. Perfectly executed. Comes in off the tag. Kofi Kingston is tagged in. He's starting to feel it here. I think it's safe to say that the action so far in the second tag team match is exactly what we expected. And I can tell you exactly what his partners are thinking right now. Why in the world did we agree to team with this guy? No reverses it. If an opponent exhibits a weakness for a specific move, some will return to utilizing that move as long as possible. Him. But he's running on half enough left. Can he score the pin? What an amazing six man tag match. your winner via pinfall few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count look at this dallas crowd shower these competitors with appreciation following an amazing matchup we have a great match coming up next we have one of the best talents on the roster to date against an imposing adversary. Who will reign supreme?
to the ring from San Diego, California, Naya Jax. Stars and there's superstar ring and one on one action, Michael. And I would say this match will have a big impact on how the other women view these competitors moving forward. Without a doubt, Cole. And given how heated the women's division is right now, even a single loss can set you back considerably. I don't match the start. Nikki Cross. Go, go, go. Come on, we need to get order here. Now hold on, Cole. Let's just see where this goes. Oh, the sledgehammer connects. That'll scramble your insides. She's taking on some heat, but you can bet she has plenty of fight in her. You know, she's the kind of competitor that actually likes getting hit. One match. We have a great match coming up next. It'll be Daniel Bryan against an imposing adversary. Who will reign supreme? Making him for Dean Pounds. Brian! Show you these two superstars with their hands on. You agree with that? It's hard. Looking as good. Yeah, Bobby Roode epitomized the word superstar. This is without a doubt a big time match for him, guys. I don't think he can afford to come up short in this one. I'd say that statement is more true now than ever before. That's how heated the competition here in WWE is right now.
Both men enter this match with tidal waves of momentum, which set them on a collision course for this very moment. It's all or nothing, and these two men wouldn't have it any other way. Man, this card is just packed with so many great matches, and this one is definitely among the most anticipated, I'd say. Now we have Daniel Bryan on the attack. There's the European uppercut, a brutal shot with the forearm. Now we have Daniel Bryan on the attack. The repetition on that move is becoming deliberate at this point. <gasps> Nothing pretty about that elbow. Vicious neck breaker. Wonder what this is all about. I think we're about to find out, Cole. He's not going to go quietly. No superstar worth his salt ever does. An early pin attempt. And Daniel Bryan avoids the early pin. Gonna take a lot more than that to keep Daniel Bryan down, Saxton. A thunderous elbow shot. He's making a statement here with this attack. And the strike connects. Daniel Bryan stalling a bit here. He's gonna wanna make sure this doesn't snowball out of control. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. He seemed more motivated than ever heading into this match, which makes me think he still has plenty of fight left in him. Look at this. And there it is again. A brutal slam changes the entire complexion of this match. Daniel Bryan with a great offensive show. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. He's fighting back here. I expected nothing less, Cole. Now there's the counter. He combines speed, agility, balance, and force all in one move. He's taking a long time to get up, guys. Perhaps playing a little possum here, Cole. Taken down with a beautiful suplex. See what kind of response we'll get. Daniel Brock, can he do it here? Shoulder got up, but I don't think it was in time. Come on, ref, finish the count. Oh man, I don't know who to root for. Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. One, two, three. There's the pin. It's over. It's all over.
Here is your winner, Daniel Bryan. And that's a win for Daniel Bryan. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders down for the three count. Guys, it sounds like we can all agree that was an extremely impressive win. Up next, we have singles action. We have a real fan favorite against Alicia Fox. You don't want to miss it. This is it, the moment we've been waiting for. The time for talking is behind us. Now these two superstars will test one another's abilities and will like never before. This is about being the best. And with the women's division as white hot as it is right now, you just know this match is gonna be one for the ages. You can see the pain on her face after that slam. A quick finish, can she do it? And Alicia Fox avoids the early pin. She got the shoulder up, that's all that counts. Bringing it back between the ropes. Four. Five. Now back to the ring. Sweat starting to form on Alicia Fox's brow. Here's what we're going to see what she's made of. Pump the brakes a bit, Cole. I know exactly what you're thinking, and I can tell you with all certainty, she still has plenty of gas left in the tank. This is another example of the carnage this beauty can create. What an unbelievable slam. She's got the shoulders down. And she gets floored by that one. Yeah, there's no staying on your feet after something like that. Going all the way up. Whoa! And she comes up short. If you're gonna leave your feet, you gotta make sure you're gonna land the move. She cinches in the headlock. And she breaks free. I don't know how she did it. That was impressive. And she strikes with great precision. Had that one well scouted. That's a classic textbook maneuver. Slips out of the ring. I like her thought process here. Oh, and she has an answer for that one. She hits her with a wicked elbow.
Look at her go. One. Bringing it back into the ring. She's looking at it. Spear! This might be Fox's night. Oh, man, Alicia Fox doesn't even know where she is. She's got her where she wants her. She shows signs of life. She's showing a lot more than that. She is on fire. Look, Elisa Fox is on the attack now. She's able to get out of the way there. This could do it. She's starting to stammer here. She definitely doesn't want to absorb much more punch. Can she do it here? One, two, three. And you can put this singles match in the books. Oh, look at, look at this. This is ridiculous. Why is this ridiculous? Take them both out at the same time. It's smart. Got to keep your head on a swivel at all times. It's highly anticipated battle between these teams, and it's happening right here next. It's the Colognes versus the Usos. Tag team action. And from behind! Oh, come on! They're trying to screw him before this match even begins. You can't be surprised. This is what needs to be done to make an impact in the tag team division. And there's no way that this team is going to be ready to go here. And the other guys are still outside screaming at him. And they love this. Of course they love it. They're the ones left standing. Referee ought to just call this one. Yeah, I agree. The superstars are ready, and so are we. Here we go. If you haven't hit record yet, now might be a good time to do that. These guys are going to have a match you'll want to watch over and over again. Nice job by Jey Uso. This is some great offense by Primo. The human body can only absorb so much of that.
He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, it's going to get a lot tougher. That one was off the mark. Awful. Just plain awful. And there's the counter. Jimmy Uso tags in. I don't like the look in his eye here, folks. Look at this. Nope, that one misses. Boy, that was terrible. It's best. He's not looking good here, Byron. No, he's got to get up, and he's got to get up now. And he lands a nice counter. Oh, no, a counter. Look out, there he goes. Knocked right off his feet. When his strikes land, you can feel it in the first few rows. He clearly did his homework heading into tonight. Whoa, look at this. What a flip. Oh, there's some good contact there by Jimmy Uso. Oh man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Knocked him right off his feet. Yeah, no kidding. Ain't no stopping him now. Perhaps Jimmy Uso has this match won now, people. Nobody does it quite like him. Oh, boy, he is. It might be cliche, but it's true here. It ain't over till it's over. Wow, Jimmy Uso just timed that perfectly. A simply devastating elbow drop. This might be the end of the road for him, Byron. Well, if he can't get back to his feet, you're absolutely right. Look at this. He's going back to an old friend with that one. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. He doesn't appear to be in a hurry to get up here. I just don't think he has it in him anymore. Made him pay there. Oh, man, what a hit. Knocked right off the apron. Saw that one coming. We've seen some great tag team action over the years here in WWE, and I can attest that this is no different. And what a reversal from Jey Uso. And off the tag is Jimmy Uso. Another great tag team match. Will he be victorious? Jey Uso knows better than he did it. it. Wow, what a match. Tag team is on a roll, Corey. That's so impressive. Not too many superstars do it oh, better. Goose here! From right behind! Blatant cheap shot by these two. Yeah, an assault and an ambush. The battle has just intensified. What a brawl! 